hey there welcome back uh the new pole is right there so they came in and uh provided electricity they decommissioned this pole though they did not pull it out of the ground i wish they would have because they hooked up the power they shut off all the other power that means i lost my well it means i lost water so luckily my neighbor was able to come out and give the birds some water here's the old stuff and that's where they clip the line so i guess it's safe to say this does not have power to it so what i need to do is i need to take this put it in that panel over there take the wire pull it out and hook it up to the other panel over there uh, i'm gonna cross a lot of fingers and uh Y'all are gonna be with me. So this says off. I don't know if that really means I don't have any juice to this or what, but I am gonna try to energize the panel. This one will give me energy to this because that power is from here to the panel. This is gonna be the one that gives me power to the one inside. Okay, yeah, I'm scared. So let me close that since that's hot. Let's try that. Okay, so I'm excited and terrified at the same time. Let's try it. I bet you the power truly is off and I don't have a tester with me, so I can't tell. Oh, and it's Saturday. So of course, oh my gosh. So that means I'm not gonna have water out here. <gasps> Oh, I don't like that. Let's try some more. Yeah, so I guess I don't have power. Ugh. I'm gonna try, I know it's late, but I'm gonna try to call these people right now. See what we can do. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, stupid. Did y'all see my dumb move? All right, stand back. Here goes the full power. That's scary. Okay. So let me find that kitchen one again. That was pretty stupid. Hopefully that was the problem, user error. I don't see anything happening. Yeah, probably the same issue. Ugh! It must be off, truly off. I might have to hook up the generator, I suppose. So I can back power everything. All right, let me figure this out, make a phone call and see what I can come up with. All right, it's the next day. I stayed up pretty stinking late working on this uh, electrical stuff. <sighs> yeah, there's no power, unfortunately. That means I lost the water to the birds. I lost the electric, the electricity to the fence, um, my fridge and the camper. So I lost all my food in there. Um, so. I wish there was better communication with the electric company. Um, for some reason there wasn't, so I don't know. Anyway, when I was working through all this last night, I realized, you know, a few things that could be tweaked. This is why I guess you kind of run through the system uh, when you don't need it. So that when that way, when you do need it, you know, everything's going to be there and working. So I'm going to go spark up the generator. Obviously it's been in storage over there. Um, here we go. It's going to supply that panel inside and then I'll power this one and then I'll power that one and then I should have water. All right, here we go. You got to love push start. Yeah, everything is off. So I'm going to turn that one on and when I turn this on, it's going to supply power. Okay, that's okay. Now, let me see if I can get one of these on. Hey! Lights! That's exciting. So, at least I know that works. Thank God. Let's see if we can get some more lights going. There's lights. So it's these three. Alright. Okay, I heard the load on the, uh, on the deal. Whoa! It's a mess. Look at that. That's great. That is so bright. 
I gotta flip that, but that's okay. That one is motion sensor. So, in theory, it'll turn on when I come in here. Now, for the well. This is what's scary. So I'm gonna have to back power this, but I don't wanna power this, because it even has power to it. So that's the service disconnect. I'm leaving that off. Um, so I'll turn this one on, and then this one on. And then, let me think this through. And turn on my well. Amen. Amen. Now, let's turn all these on. And this has a hole in it? That sucks. Now this is on. I'm gonna let them trees get some water. The birds are getting water now. All right. Thank the Lord that works. I got water. Don't realize how important water is until you don't have it. Now everything should be good. I should be, let me go plug, replug the camper back in so I can charge my batteries. Now I'm gonna get going with some other stuff. I will, uh, I'll get with y'all next time. I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Okay, a new day. And I got the power on. Uh, they just simply came and just adjusted the meter. It was all, it was all via computer. So they came and they, they, the guys flipped it on. Um, they came out here pretty, pretty quickly actually. I called uh, just after eight in the morning when they opened up and these guys were out here within about an hour or so. I'm pretty thankful for that. Um, anyway, I came in, um, as y'all know, I kind of hooked up the um, generator and started working through the problems that I had. I couldn't get this fan working. Um, I wasn't quite sure what was going on. Um, stupid, stupid, simple things. Um, like for this, for this fan in here, the, uh, the issue was one of my wires in this switch uh, slipped out of the wire nut. Uh, that's totally my fault. I fixed it, fan worked. Um, I came in here in the bathroom and the fan didn't work and the lights didn't work. I was like, oh man. But then I realized there was no light bulbs in there and now there is one. So then that worked, it's a miracle. It's amazing, you need a light bulb for the lights to work. <laughs> Who would have known? My light identified as having a light bulb in it and it still didn't work. But anyway, it works now. So then my fan didn't work. I said, oh rats. So I took one of the light bulbs from here because I did have two in there originally. I took one of the light bulbs, I put it up in there and that was the issue for that. But the other issue was I didn't have my fan plugged in. So that was a stupid thing, that was all me. But again, an easy fix. Thankfully, it was an easy fix. Um, I came in here, this is so messy, I don't even want y'all to see it, but my motion sensor works and those other lights work. Those are amazing, amazing, amazing lights. The Hyperlight, wow. It's, it's brighter than daytime in here. Everything's working. Thank God, so awesome. Now I need to just get going on, finish up this, the, the grout here in the bathroom and then the floor. Put some doors and trim on. I'm working on the countertops of the house. I'm building them and we're almost done. But honestly, my energy level is dropping horribly bad. I'm getting tired, I'm getting tired. I work a lot during the week and then I come here and I work my tail off. The heat is killing me. So I'm just tired. My body's hurting, I'm tired. Um, and I'm too thick headed to take a break. So the only kind of break I've been getting is mowing. If you call that a break, at least it's still some kind of work, but that's, that's what's going on. But I'm trying to push through and get done because when I can get a couch right here and just come on in and sit down and relax and maybe put the TV on, take a little breather, that's gonna be great. All the hard work will be worth it. So anyway, thanks again, once again, for sticking around for this video. Again, please subscribe if you have not yet. I'm still trying to grow this channel and stay tuned for more. There's a lot more coming. Got a lot more plans going on here. All right, appreciate your time. Thank you, bye.